A Lewis and Clark County judge has ruled the suspect in the murder of Broadwater County Deputy Mason Moore may be forcibly medicated. MTN's Evelyn Schultz is live in the studio with more. Evelyn. Melissa, in June of last year, Lloyd Barris was found unfit to stay in trial. Doctors said he suffered from a number of mental health disorders. The order comes after hearings in December and January involving expert testimony. The judge was trying to determine whether the state should be able to involuntarily medicate Barris to get him to a point where he's fit to stand trial. Authorities accused Lloyd Barris's son Marshall of fatally shooting Deputy Moore during a pursuit. It happened near Three Forks on May 16th, 2017. Lloyd and Marshall Barris then led law enforcement on a chase that ended near Missoula. Marshall died in a shootout with officers. This week's order points to a similar shootout and standoff Barris was involved in in the year 2000 in California. There, he was initially found unfit to stand trial. Court records show Barris was involuntarily medicated and responded well enough, so the case proceeded. Judge Seeley also said some expert witness testimony advocating for psychotherapy without medication is impractical. To medicate Barris, doctors are required to follow appropriate safety measures and monitor him for potential side effects. They must also update the court on the status of treatment and requests for changes to the treatment plan. Melissa, back to you. Thanks, Evelyn. Barris has been charged with five felonies in the shooting death of Deputy Mason Moore, including deliberate homicide by accountability, two counts of attempted deliberate homicide, assault on a peace officer, and unlawful possession of a firearm by a convicted person. If convicted, he faces a maximum penalty of life in prison without parole.